Yo, what up? Sage One, what we talking about? We talking about... Holla, shout out my nigga Jake. Holding it down, nigga the god of rap. Hey, yo, what we talking about? We talking about like... Nigga, it's all your choice, man. Freedom of will, man. Free will, freedom of choice, excuse me. It's all up to you, man. Everything that's happened so far is because of you. And I don't say that in a blaming type of way, like... It's because of you that I'm fucked up. Nah. Everything that's happening in your life and how you feel is because of how you feel. <laughs> See how that works? However you feel is how you feel. Now, if you happen to not be aware and present, then a feeling might creep in. You didn't know it creeped in. And then all of a sudden you think you're sad or happy. You're not. Or you are. But you just weren't aware of the transition of feelings. And therefore, you're not in control of it. And you can't change it, transition to the next feeling. Like, if you're sad, why would you want to be sad? You most likely want to be happy. So, be happy. It's in the words, it's in our language, it's coded in everything we do say. Be happy. It doesn't say, go outside and do this and do that, and then you're happy. They can say, be happy. Follow after me. Be happy. That's it. At first, everything seems hard. With practice and time, everything becomes second nature. Using that knowledge, we can all agree that that is true. Leave a comment or tell me if you believe that's not true. What exists that you cannot become better at with practice and time? And we'll talk about it, but until then, we can become better anything we practice for so anyway that whole part was whack I'm gonna, I'm gonna edit that out um it's all on you man if you're broke there's a long line of things and a long line of thoughts and feelings that you had and reactions that you had to situations that put you in that position yes you can go and blame another and given uh, I'll give you that, yes, we all co-create, and so we all are co-to blame for what happens. But we can't blame each other because it's equal co-blame. So we have to blame ourselves or blame no one. Just stop blaming. You know, you don't have to play the blame game. Just be. But if you're going to play the blame game, at least blame yourself first. You know, at least look into yourself first. Even when I tell somebody something like you're ugly, it's because of the ugly part inside of me. You know, look at my face. I got vitiligo all over my face. I feel ugly sometimes. And so when I see somebody else that's butt ugly, or who I think is butt ugly, I already know, like, I'm scared to look like that. Fear. Fear will kill you. Death is not even real, and fear will still kill you. I, don't, I respect fear. But I uh, face, I face it. So I'm facing ugliness, and I'm letting my vitiligo come out. You know, I'm with women; they ain't got nothing to say about it. So my self-esteem is high. But uh, there are times that I feel I look like a weirdo. Be that as it may, that's all on me. There's nobody else I can blame for feeling like that. Oh, but you said I look like this, or. Oh, but you know what I mean? Look, man, it's my fault I feel this way. I'm going to own up to the way I feel. I want to be happy this morning and today. I am happy. That's it. I don't need nobody else's wisdom or knowledge or anything to make myself happy. It's called myself. It's me. Why would I need you for it? I guess the point today is be happy. If you don't want to be happy, be whatever you choose to be, man. I'm with that. I got your back. I support you. Safe one. I'm on the highway, man. I'm trying to.